KS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is for Wednesday, July 3rd. I'm James Spann. You know it's going to be hot and humid. And you know we'll have scattered storms around. We think they'll be a little more numerous today and each day for the rest of the week as moisture levels increase. Let's take a look. Here's the upper look, and that looks like July. The prime jet stream up north. Winds aloft here are light and variable, so storms that pop up today will be slow movers. Little action on radar early this morning at 5 o'clock. Got a cluster of showers over Hale County, south of Tuscaloosa, some light rain over eastern Mississippi. We haven't seen much on radar at this hour of the day, the last couple of days. And that's typically a sign we'll see a few more showers and storms around this afternoon, probably more than recent days. We're in the 70s to start the day. Highs today should be in the upper 80s and low 90s, not quite as hot as yesterday with the increase in showers we're expecting later. Got a heat advisory in effect for parts of Florida and South Georgia. Otherwise, things are quiet around here. Organized severe storms well to the north. We also note a marginal risk over the Florida Peninsula today. This is tomorrow for the 4th of July, and this is Friday, day three. Again, we're solidly in the green, so we'll have some thunder, but organized severe weather not expected here. Rain for the next seven days. The west is dry. Heavier totals down here in the southeast expected to be maybe a little east of here, but no doubt we'll see some heavy downpours, but rain distribution uneven because of the scattered nature of the storms. The Atlantic Basin quiet. Good news for beach goers. No tropical storms, hurricane worries out in the Atlantic Basin or the Gulf anytime soon. But over in the Pacific, Hurricane Barbara. It's a whopper of a hurricane here. This thing has sustained winds of 155 miles per hour. But it's far from land, way west of Mexico, and this will start to weaken in coming days. And by the time we get to Sunday, it should be just a weakening tropical depression east of Hawaii. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS. This is the 06C run at 4 o'clock this afternoon, troughing over the western states. And around here, it's just old summertime. Highs today, 87 to 93 Partly sunny with scattered showers and storms, probably more numerous than recent days as we note an increase in the precipitable water values and the air aloft should be a bit colder. Same thing tomorrow and the same thing Friday, a mixture of clouds and sunshine with scattered showers and storms, most of them between about 1 and 9 o'clock, but there could be a few late night or morning rogue showers about. This is Saturday and this is Sunday, the weekend not changing much, highs Low 90s, the sun out at times, scattered showers and storms both days. And next week, Monday and Tuesday, maybe a touch drier as the heights come up. Showers a bit more widely spaced. Here's Wednesday, upper high developing west of the state. And again, we'll see scattered showers and storms around. Let's go out 10 days. This is Friday of next week, the 13th. I'm sorry, Friday the 12th. Again, the jet stream up north, and it's the same old thing we'll be talking about through the rest of the summer. Hot, muggy, a few scattered storms. Models, the synoptic scale models out here don't have the grid resolution to handle the small scale features that really determine the day-to-day -day variations in thunderstorm coverage. This is the uh, precipitation output coming off the uh, European Ensemble. And the mean's about uh, one, one and a half to two inches, but your number will vary. And highs mostly low 90s and lows mostly low 70s. It's just good old summertime weather. That's it for the Weather Extreme video today. Notes on the blog. We're on a holiday schedule, so one video per day for the rest of this week. But again, we'll have fresh notes later. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no-interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.